So today I am currently on my way to Hades and I thought we'd do things a little bit different. Now you're gonna have to excuse me. I am driving, I am driving my mobility scooter to Hayley's. Now obviously I'm not going to be recording the whole time that we are driving there because it takes nearly an hour to get there. But um, it is raining today so I thought um, that what I'd do is do a little behind the uh, scenes of what we do when we're not doing scooter buddies um, so you see what else we do um, because we don't just do obviously meet on Tuesdays and Thursdays and scoot buddies there's more to it than that and um, so yeah I thought that we'd share some of that side of things so yeah um, so I, um, yeah that's basically what I'm doing so I got up at five this morning a really crappy night oh god I did my makeup and I was going to try and look nice for you all but clearly that went wrong but hey ho um, I'm currently on the path so don't panic um, yeah, um, what was I saying? It's too early. So I got up at five and I left at six to get to Hayley's. Now I'll do another live when I'm close to Hayley's. Last time, last week on Thursday, I got there at about, I think it was about quarter past seven. So it took about 45 minutes. Now today it's raining um, and I'm having to use lights, window wiper. So I don't know how that's gonna affect my battery today. So it'll be interesting to see. Um, so that'll be, hopefully we'll make it. I've got my charger and everything. Um, and hopefully everything will be fine. Um, my lights are LED, so we'll see what happens. Um, so first port call, of course, is a coffee. I need a coffee for my long, long journey. So I've got my takeaway cup next to me, ready. Um, and so I'm currently going to our closest garage that I know is open at six. Um, so I'm going there, getting a coffee, and then I will carry on. Bye bye. So I have my coffee. I have a muffin. Back to it. So it should take about 45 minutes. 40 minutes to get a Hayley's now. So when I so Hayley's in Webbing, when I get sort of, I don't know, boring way, I will come back on. I like to listen to my radio. Fair enough. 
but she looks at me and she just shakes her head with a furious face. I felt like pulling over as if say, what's your problem? But obviously I don't because I don't have that kind of confidence. Um, it just makes me so cross and upset. It really does. Like, why? One, I'm, I shouldn't have to just myself. Is it justify myself? I don't know. Two, what gives you the right to judge me anyway? And three, you know, until you've got an illness, you're not going to understand it anyway, are you? I guess there's people like that in the world who just don't understand. But, oh, I get it all the time. And it makes me so cross. Oh, tank is going down now so cross and mad oh I just I just I, I had to come on and have a mind you know what right do people have to judge it takes a lot of confidence to one even go out in the first place two and I'm not old I'm not young I'm in between but it's having that confidence in the first place to friggin go out Oh, it frustrates me, it upsets me, and if it upsets me, how many other people does it upset? Do you know what I mean? So, just think before you act or speak to someone in a scooter, just because they don't have a walking stick sticking out, just because they look normal. Don't do it, don't say anything, there's no need to do it, okay? Anyway run over so anyway I'm where am I I'm goring by sea there you go I'm goring by sea um so I got about another 20 minutes ago maybe um I haven't heard from Hayley I think she's still in bed hopefully not <coughs> um so we've got lots to do we're going to do some promoting um obviously today's rained off because it's raining don't do scooter buddies in the rain i'll probably come back on and give you another update in a bit so yeah see you soon so i have made it to hayley's and she isn't dressed because her clothes are in the dryer uh, because they're wet so um at hayley's say morning Um, so when she's more awake, we'll do more of an update. So we'll see you soon. Bye! So we are back again. <laughs> Here's Hayley. So we have bought another bag, same as my bag, as you Modeled can see. Modelled by Hayley. <laughs> Modelled by Hayley. The reason we have done this is because my bag is so heavy when we do scoot bag, uh, buddies. So, scoot bags. Scoot bags, <laughs> yeah. Scoot bags. And Hayley's dressed now. Ta da! <laughs> so we. Um, when we started out, we didn't need so much stuff. No. And now we do. Now we do. So now we've got a bag each. Yep. So we split uh, it so it's not so blooming heavy. So. We're getting organised. Yeah. So we have. So what do we keep in our bags, Hayley? What do we keep in our bags? We I put keep, everything in there. We also, keep our diaries. Yeah. We need a diary. We keep leaflets. Yeah. Iris, wonderful load of medication. <laughs> yeah. Well, I had to bring that to everything because, um. I haven't taken them actually, I need to take them. It's also moisturiser for. <laughs> oh, that's for <laughs> Mum! <laughs> I forgot about that, but we'll give that to Mum later. Uh, Mum's not actually, Mum was supposed to be looking after my dogs today because the husband's working. And we're meant so, to be doing scooter buddies, but as you can see, it's we raining. Because the weather, so today yes. we're like, right, let's just get on with stuff that needs to be done. Yes. So we also keep our yellow high vis jackets for our health and safety. Yeah. So one is going to go into my bag, one is in Tara's. We also keep the ID badges. So for every group, we all have a name badge. Um, 
Where Vin Sexton. can't remember who I am and uh, <laughs> they can't remember who each other is. No, we all forget names, so it just makes life easier. Yeah, easy we have Where Vin and Little Hampton. Um, we call them our medals. Yeah. <laughs> Please give prizes. We keep a first aid kit with us on every session. We do, we do. Um, and we also keep um, another uh, note journal for writing down details of new customers or participants or the clients. I know, group members. Group members, that sounds better. And we keep our clipboard, which is... Um, for signing in and payments. So we know who's here, who's not here. Absolutely. And then we also keep our radios. Again, this is for health and safety. So Tyra wears a radio at the front. I wear a radio at the back um, so that we can communicate. Um, for example, in Littlehampton, there is a train that runs up and down the promenade so that we can communicate when the train is coming up so we know when to move over. And also, especially in uh, school holidays, um, it gets very busy, um, so we have to also watch out for big crowds and coaches coming down. Absolutely. So it's it's always good to have communication at front and back. Now another reason that Tara's bag is always so heavy. Oh God, is here she's we go. A freaking jailer. <laughs> <laughs> I keep saying I'm going to sort my keys out. I'm so glad. Oh, so that's my medication alarm. Yes, I've got to do it. Oh, look, nine o'clock, everyone. It's nine o'clock. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to be taking that in a bit. Oh, um, turn that off. And then today we've also got spare leaflets because we are going to um, several locations in Worthing. And um, we're taking you with us because it's uh, behind the scenes day. So we can show you where we're going to be leaving them today. Maybe you will spot one out and about. Yes. So, yeah, so yeah, we um maybe we could do find a leaflet, it. tell us where you found it, and you get I don't know, a free key ring yeah. through the post. Find a leaflet, get a key ring. Find yeah. Yeah, we could do that. We could do that. Tell like us that. where you find it. We can definitely do that. Just trying to figure out what I actually do need in my bag. I'm not very alert. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I've got the dentist in like 40 minutes and it's throwing me off. Yeah. Nobody wants to go to the dentist. I keep biting my own cheek. It's, I, I just, I don't know what's wrong with my gob. I mean, you think it would be big enough, but apparently not. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I keep shaking. I keep laughing. <laughs> <laughs> Can you imagine if you laugh still? <laughs> <laughs> oh, dear. Oh, anyway. So yeah, we're going to pack these up, take them with us today. We also have the um, maps in here of Brooklands for our routes that we take. Yeah, Hayley, because you're really good at that, aren't you? Oh, God, I keep getting lost. How can you get lost around one field? <laughs> yes, yes. Still manage it, still manage it. Yeah. My brain just doesn't work like that. No. So, yeah. So, what what um, name tags have you got there? So, I have got the name tags for Worthing. Have you? Um, and... <laughs> yes. Oh, well done. And you have the name tags for Littlehampton, which is stupid because I now lead Littlehampton. You now lead Worthing, so really we should... Yeah. But we're just... I live in Worthing, so we're just... Yeah. Whatever's. Is that my new diary? Oh, it's a bumblebee. I know, it's really cute, right? It says be happy. And why have you got a new diary, Hayley? Um, because I'm not very organised and um, this is life. <laughs> <laughs> there uh, we no, go. Because obviously um, things are happening with um, Scooter Buddies. Um, we may have an update for you soon. Um, yeah, on the way here when I was driving, I said we might share this bit later on. I'm going to... We're going to decide a bit later, aren't we? See, I just, I don't know, I don't know. Yeah, that. I'm just the tag along, I make no decisions. It's a good thing too, because my brain can't handle it. Why have got a polka dot pad? So the polka dot pad is for notes of things like, um, sometimes I'll see like different games that I think might be appropriate for fun days where they are um, I might bump into someone who might give a suggestion um, about a funding or um, a client might be thinking about joining I might take their details so that we can give them a message let them know when the next groups and stuff are on um, that kind of thing okay um, 
just so that we can be as helpful as we can, really. Cool. Um, yeah. Awesome. How's your bag going? Cause it looks quite flat compared to mine. I know yours is like bolted out to the extreme, isn't it? I know. Um, Killed my battery on the way here. Yeah. Medication on me. You're gonna laugh. I carry Rene because I suffer with IBS, and I know that if I'm better, better windy. I know it's gonna trigger off, so that stops it. Got a modium in case we go the other way. <laughs> Headache stuff because I'm only allowed to take paracetamol with the medication that I'm on. Yeah. Um, and I used to take a lot of ibuprofen, so Tara actually bought me this forehead stick, um, so that I can use that, which is really helpful for when I'm out and about. Um, so that's that. That can go in the front of it. Hand gel, which we both carry a bottle of, um, just in case you never know what you might touch that may be sticky. <laughs> yes. And then obviously radio and a charger, which we talked about. Cool, so is my bag nice and light now? Not yet. Yeah. <laughs> uh, so, obviously you've got your own personal crap in here. <laughs> no tape. So when, when was the last time you cleaned your bag? Was it like that? It's been a while. Okay. I use my bag a lot, do I not? Yeah, we, we're going to have to see any of that. Okay. So... Tara's folder back in. First aid kit. Do you want to carry or I can put it in mine? Don't mind. Don't mind. <laughs> <laughs> yours is still heavy. How's yours still heavy? I don't know. Um, leaflet. Uh, ID tags in there. But then Tara does also carry um, like... Uh, microphones and recording, uh, equipment. recording equipment. So these we need to divide and conquer. <laughs> well, hopefully we'll get rid of some of them today. Hopefully that is what we want, isn't it? Yep. Well, I have to say, no. Oh. <laughs> we should have used that one. <laughs> Uh, until the next bit hopefully we'll be out so Hayley has just gone into the dentist rather her than me and then we start our journey so um, hopefully she won't be in there long she's gone in there about her bad tooth or a hole in her tooth can't remember what she said now um, so I'm sat in the car waiting um all I feel like I've done today is sit on my bottom. Uh, we sorted out the bag, so we've got her bag there, and mine in front of me, full of leaflets, all ready to go. Um, oh, if I thought about it, we could have put a leaflet in there. Might send her back in when she comes out. Anyway, um, yeah, so we've got leaflets ready, and then I think we're heading into Worthing Town first. Not sure. Um, so do a quick update of when she gets out, see how she got on, and then we'll move on. Right. How did the dentist go, Hayley? So, well, I keep biting myself, he's ground my tooth right down. I was a brave kill. Um, so that is feeling better once the swelling goes down. I shouldn't be biting myself. And I have a filling that fell out that side, which is why I have a hole in the side of my tooth, which makes sense, because I just thought a hole appeared from nowhere. And I need a filling on the top one. But I said to him, and they agreed, it, it is, when I brush my teeth, I mainly focus on my back ones, because I know they're bad, but um, I think it's medication. Okay. That's not helping with the teeth, so not surprising. I take 17 tablets a day, so, you know. <laughs> so when are you going back? 13th of September to have two fillings. Yay. Yay. And, um... Yeah, it should be nice and quick because I don't prat around with, um, not prat around, I shouldn't say it like that. I don't have um, anaesthetic when it's a filling, so I should be in and out, hopefully. Cool, ma'am. Yeah. Obviously, if I was having a tooth out, then I do have. Yeah. Um, thing. But yeah, so, all good. So, um, I did a recording as you went in to let them all know that you just gone in. And I said, hey, you should take a leaflet in. Well, I'm going back in September. September? Just with 
27th of August now. No, we're not. We're in, we're in July, Hayley. Oh, Jesus Christ, I haven't got fillings until September. Oh, realisation on Hayley's face. <laughs> but, granted, I did say I wasn't going to rush. Who is for that? <laughs> but do they have leaflets in there, Hayley? That's the question I'm just trying to establish. I don't, I don't think they do. Oh. I don't think they do. Okay. But I will have another look when I go back in there, but I, I've never noticed a leaflet board or anything. Oh. Okay, cool. Yeah. So let's go on our journey and begin. Coffee? Coffee, Coffee. first. Hayley's earned a coffee. Hayley went in the dentist chair and had her tooth grounded. Okay. Oh, that was really sensitive, that was. Well, 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 well. It only gets to a certain point, you're like, do I tell him to stop or do I just wait until it's finished? Do I just wait until it's finished? <laughs> <laughs> okay, so let's go get yeah. coffee where we can drop leaflets and maybe put a poster in her window as well. And carry on. Okay. We'll see you guys in a bit. In a bit. Hello, me again. So we've just been in town and we've brought some equipment I would show you, but it's in the boot um, for our scooter buddies office supplies, I guess you'd call it. Tara was very slow walking because her foot's hurting. So I thought I'd share what she's currently doing. Let me turn you around. Hi. <laughs> so Tara is currently sitting with, my foot out. sitting with her foot out of the car because she has a swollen toe with, um, bubbles on i've forgotten what the bubbles are called i don't know it, it's bloody painful basically it's loads of little blisters and um it, it's it's so sore and and i don't have much feeling in that toe currently because it really hurts and i'm not sure if that's true to my back because my back's hurting as well um but it hurts. So she's just put some um, antiseptic savalon on it and I've told her to just let it soak in before she puts the sock on yeah. and just chill out. God, you know, I really cannot remember what the bubbles are called. No, I call it... If I remember, I'll let you guys know later. Yeah. Yeah, so... Uh, We're having a quick rest. Quick rest and... and I'll put my sock back on. <laughs> sock back on, yeah. A fluffy, fluffy sock. This, this is how it goes. If I don't have my scooter with me, it's a little trot stop. Little, little trot, trot stop. stop. It's terrible. Or we, we hire a scooter or we get a wheelchair. But today we've got neither, so it's stop. Yeah, we've got stop. the car, obviously, but there's stop. only so close or you can park. Or lean on a wall. Or lean on a wall. Yeah. It's just like, oh. Today is not the day to be leaning on walls. <laughs> no, I just want to try. It's too wet. Today. It's wet out there and, yeah, miserable. pretty miserable. Look, right, I've just noticed want... there's a yeah. tiny little bird box on that sign up there. How Quite random. cute. I'm really sorry that I'm shaking, but my arm... Um, She's got a shake. Uh, it's the medication. For some reason, I'm trying to stabilise you with both and Don't hands. you find it really frustrating? Like, you know you're in pain, but you're just like, we've got, we've got things to do. Yeah, got stuff to do. Oh, you've just come back into focus. Oh, focus. Ooh. Oh, focus. Doesn't she look beautiful, we've got people? Stuff to do. You're in pain, but we'll get it done. It'll just take all day to get it done. We always get it done. That's we'll, we'll how we roll done. in the Scooter Buddy Shout. <laughs> yeah, we'll get it done. Okay. Right. Catch up in a bit. Oi. Oi. Me again. Uh, just a brief one because I just had a brainwave. The bubbles on Tara's toes, they are called. Pomphy locks. There you go. That's it. Brain energy done for the day. Bye. So we have been to what is that cafe called? It's amazing. Coffee, milk. milk. Oh no! I picked up a card. Damn it! Don't worry. We'll edit this. Anyway, so we are now going to the library to see if we can put up leaflets or poster. Uh, been to the council, I'm not allowed to put them in there. Uh, I'm not going to talk about it on camera. We don't want to get in trouble. But, I um, have so very much to say, but we're not going to. And I will deal with it, but now is not the time. No. So, so now we're going to try the library. But this is completely typical of our journey through life. Life, <laughs> yeah. Trying to do oh, good for the world. A tree, walked into a tree. Right. So now we're going to try to do council. We'll be back. No, we're going to try and do the library. No, library. <laughs> okay, sorry. So we have put them in and they're going to review them. And 
Hopefully put them out. It's hard trying to get the word out, but got to try. We have got to try, haven't we, Hayley? Yeah. So it's very difficult where you have a condition where your my stress levels get high, and it's very hard not to bite people's heads off. Now, most people can control this. Me, on the other hand, I'm starting to get very hot and <laughs> very flustered. So I'm going to have a breather. Just going to have, have a fresh chill air. out time. And then we're going to do more because I want to make a difference. This is why we're doing this. Yeah, and, um, and we want to help others like ourselves. That's the idea because we go through it. We know how hard it is to get out there. Yeah. And I think the trouble is when you're dealing with people that perhaps don't understand. That's where the problem starts. And you feel like, I don't take rejection very well. I feel like I'm being rejected. <laughs> you know, well, we do, we do get rejected a lot because yeah. they look at you as if say, well, what's that? They don't want to know more about it. But we shall not give up. We will not stop. We will not be Whoops. put down. No. We will be us. Yes. And we will find our way. We will find our path like we have in Littlehampton. Yeah. Well, things a bigger place. I think it's just a little bit harder, but we're getting there. And we've yeah. met some amazing people today. We yeah. have met some people not so amazing, but we have met some amazing people. But if one of these cars right now splashes me as it drives past, then I'm going to lose my poop. It'll be fine, Hayley. It'll be all good. Anyway, coffee. <laughs> So we'll be back. I think we should try the theatre. We could try the theatre, couldn't we? Our group went to the theatre together the other day, which was amazing because that's exactly what we wanted to happen. It's gone from they've all come separately to they've built enough friendship and confidence to go out together to the to cinema. How cool is that? Oh, that is like gosh. really amazing. Really proud of our group at Littlehampton. I'm proud Absolutely. of them. We go that way, don't we? It's theatre. Do, do you know what we shouldn't do? What? We shouldn't take our phones while we're trying to cross a busy road. <laughs> yeah, probably not, but we're stuck here now. Anyway, Rising. we'll be back. Uh, can I just say, yeah. I did brush my hair. Did you? <laughs> it's just I keep walking into trees and it's windy. So, you know, I do make an effort sometimes. Sometimes. <laughs> okay, we're going to go so we get across the road safely. Okay, we are back in the car. Hayley has calmed down a bit. Dun, dun, dun. <laughs> we are giving out some more leaflets, haven't we? We have indeed. Um, Don't say where. Don't say where, because we remember we're doing a thing. So, if you find any of our leaflets and you pick one up and you contact us and say where you got it from and you let us know, we will send you a key ring. <laughs> it'll be the first three people who contact us that could get ridiculous <laughs> yeah we have only so many keyrings <laughs> yeah so it's first three people who contact us got it got it got it cool Where so are we, we are going to our next destination oh, which we can't tell you about so no but you know it's within Worthing but you know you may realise in the background so you Maybe. Know, look for the clues. Mm. <laughs> yeah, we'll give you a clue when we get there. Yeah? Right, yes. Right? Well, yes. Well, well, we'll do another video, won't we? So we can just... We shall. They might be able to spot where we are in the background. I'll tell you what, though. I'm blooming boiling. Oh, I'm really hot too. And I'm hungry and I need a wee. <laughs> All this. But here's the first clue. There's a toilet at this next location. <laughs> yes, there is. Yes. Yes. Okay, we'll catch up with you in a minute where we can reach our location. <laughs> yeah, I'm not doing that face. Hi! <laughs> Bye! Okay, so we have just been to our last location. Uh, we didn't do a recording in there because it just would have given it all away, wouldn't it, Hayley? Yeah, we couldn't really do that. So but we can give you a clue. Yes, we can. Which is? You can never get parking. Never. And if you do get parking, you have to pay a fortune. Hmm. Wonder where this could possibly be. <laughs> and there are toilets. There are toilets. 
Hmm. And um, we visit there a lot. That's probably enough with the clues, Dr. <laughs> probably enough. Ooh, we're steaming up. Oh, we are. Hot stuff. Hot stuff. So we are now going to go and get something to eat. If you come in, Hayley, we, we can both be in the camera. Oh, look at that. <laughs> so, um, yeah, we're going to go and quick get something to eat. Then we're going to go back to yours. Are we doing that? And then we're going to do some paperwork. And dirty, dirty words. <laughs> yeah. Um, but we'll be back. Cool oh, we're just ups. being cruel today. We yeah. are, we are. But hopefully it'll keep them enticed. Sorry, I actually can't sit at that angle. It's really hurting. Okay. <laughs> So yeah, toe really hurts as well, so I, I can't do much walking. Wow. No, we're, we're done with that today. Yep. Okay, see you in a bit. Bye. Love, bye. <laughs> so we've just had something to eat and Hay's really happy. <laughs> we're just going back to our own locations because apparently I'm not allowed to leave. I'll leave it in there, so very sad. So the last location that we gave you clues as to um, no parking and if you do get parking it's expensive and that it has toilets they have rejected our leaflets they will not display them in a certain bit so, so we are going back to collect them going back to collect them and hopefully find out why it is that they won't display them we have learned that it's very hard to put leaflets anywhere unless it's supporting someone else and i'm sure it's because it's not well, I don't know why. Maybe it's because it's not free. But we're not for profit. We have to charge £3 a person to cover a cost. We don't take a wage from it. A lot of the equipment and that we've brought out of our own pockets. You know, and it says on the leaflets that we're not for profit, you know. It's very really hard and frustrating. It is hard and frustrating. But, you know, we're trying hey, to help people. <laughs> we are trying. So, we'll carry on. We've got a little Hampton out and we could get working up. We'll get that. And we're just about to find out why, so we'll let you know why. Yep, we'll be back. So, we're back. Uh, went into the hospital. Hayes has gone for dogs. And, um, that's where we went. And they said that they're, they're not allowed to put posters or leaflets up so that's a shame um i'm home no i'm not i'm back at Haley's. i'll let her go because i'm in so much pain um, i'm just resting my foot on her sofa like so waiting for her to come back and then um doing some paperwork um but yeah you can see part of, I don't know, behind the scenes. I mean, obviously we don't do this every time. But especially starting a new group, there is a lot of promoting, trying to get the word out, and booking in, and sorting, and talking, getting things set up for... Scooter bodies, that's what it's about. Word of mouth, talking to different people, going out on scooters, trying to hand out leaflets if we see someone on a scooter, get talking to them, see if they want to join, share what we're about, and stuff like that. So, yeah. So, we'll come back on when Hay gets back with the dogs. I, c I just couldn't do it. I'm in pain, my back really hurts, and my toe is killing. I don't know what's going on with my toe, I might have to go to doctors. So, and I'm tired now, it's catching up with me that I've been up so early, and the fact that I wake up during the night is not helping in pain. But it's all good. So, till he gets back. Hi, so. We actually um, decided that we won't go do paperwork and we're knackered basically, totally wiped out. It's been a really, really long day and decided that we're going to call it words as Hay's coming over tomorrow anyway. Um, it was a bit late and so um, I'm driving home. So, what we're going to do is do like two-day part behind the scenes because that is exactly what it is anyway. Um, I'm not sure what time Kay is coming over today but in the afternoon we have a really important phone call which I'm really excited about um, and I 
we will be sharing uh, what it's for. Um, tomorrow, we're going to reveal all as such. Um, it's really exciting. It's a massive step for Scoot Buddies. It's a scary step. It's a massive step. Um, that's why I don't want to say too much right now. Because we've been, I've been doing Morales Ventures for three years. And last year. until midday. I'm not currently wearing a Rolls t-shirt um, because we haven't got, we've got a telephone meeting. I'm, doing, I'm just getting ready by the way. Um, we've got a telephone meeting. It's not, it's a Zoom meeting um, later on uh, but not until I think it's five o'clock. Um, so Hayley's coming over kind of midday um, and we are going to do some of this paperwork that we keep going on about. Um, now, basically, I'm not going to fully go into details. We'll do that together. But... Uh, it is going to hopefully open doors for Rara Ross. Well, more, not Rara Ross, but Scooter Buddies. It will be just Scooter Buddies, not Rara Ross at all. And it will be able, it will enable us to grow, help more people in the community, which would be amazing. Um, <clears throat> and stuff like that, which is really exciting. So, you know, it's all positives. It's just a bit... So, I'm putting on my fake face, as I'm calling it, because I've got a mat. I slept better last night. But, oh, my God, I hurt. I really, really hurt. Um, got in last night. I was absolutely pooped. I was in nice pain. Um, really, really struggled. I had dinner. I went to bed about quarter to eight, I think. I was like, oh my god. I was, I was just knackered. Just couldn't do it. 
just couldn't do it. This thing we we too have illnesses. That's the problem. Um, we try. That's what it's all about. Um, so today will be easier because one, we're not walking around. Two, um, I don't have to go anywhere. Hayley's coming to me. Nicely, she drives a car. So I'd stay home, rest my toe. Um, I don't know where the contact stopped or not about it. Oh, I don't know. It flares up and it goes down. I think it's that condition Hay said. I don't think it's to do with the diabetes. That's why I'm not too concerned. And I've been putting on um, Savalon and Septic. And it does look a bit better. So, you know, progress. So I'm going to see maybe how it is over the weekend. Because it's Friday today. Um, I'm crap at makeup. Don't judge me. I'm just putting on the fake face. Win it. That's what I say in it, in it. Um, yeah, see what it's like over the weekend. Keep putting on the saddle on. And then, I don't know, see how it is. Um, hopefully, it'll go down. It'll be okay. And um, I've got to leave my eye out. Uh, hopefully, it'll be okay. If not, I'll... Uh, call doctors, but they always go, can you send a picture? Um, so I'll probably have to send a picture and to show them what, whatever, take it from there. So what I'll do is I'll probably won't do an update now until Hayley gets there and then I think I was sort of teasing you and actually tell you what's going on. Could we have confirmed with each other that we're definitely going through with what we're going to do, which is a really big step for us. And it's scary, to be honest. Um, but it's something we need to do. We need to do it if we want to go any, any further good buddies basically so yeah we're going to do it it's going to take us far hopefully my hair is awful god so long like rapunzel <laughs> okay so i'm going to go and brush the top because hubby's not here at the minute because he brushes the bottom so i'll get hay to brush the bottom when she gets here <laughs> um, so I think my shoulder pops out that hypo hypo movie that. Um, so we'll catch up with you when he gets here and we'll let you know what's going on don't forget first three people to find a poster in Webbing and you tell us where you found it you've got to tell us the name of the place that you found it we'll send out a free key ring to you okay so we'll catch up with you later. Bye. So our behind uh, scenes exciting news that we keep teasing you with <laughs> is Hayley. We are now registered as a community interest company. Yay! <laughs> so what does this mean? This means that we are now able to apply for funding and fundraise for ourselves so that we can help do more for our clients slash participants of Scooter Buddies. Which we have been working towards for ages. A year We've been to get to a this year. point. Yeah. yeah. We're still non-profit. We are not for profit. We don't take a wage. We are purely 
um, registering so that we can get, raise some more money to help with scooter buddies. As for the last year, it's come out of my entire's pocket, yeah. um, which obviously everyone goes through when they're starting something. Of course. Um, but of we want to be able to offer more. We want to be able to cover things like um, uh, in the tubes. on Fundays and our, all of that kind of thing. Yeah. And um, we'll, we'll take it from there and perhaps do like a fundraising day um, for ourselves. Absolutely. Which is really um, So we'll still be charging a three pound, won't we? Yeah, three pound um, a person. Um, because that all helps. helps. Yeah. And it um, covers our, like, what well, doesn't cover, but it, it helps towards the monthly costs. Um, but yeah, we're really excited. That is our exciting mm. news that we've been wanting to share with you. Yes. So anyway, um, yeah. So that is just some of the things that we do behind the scenes, yeah. and we want to share this with you. And so we've, we've plans for the future, of course, that we're always going to be updating and sharing with you. So we really hope that you've enjoyed watching this video and. We'd love to hear your feedback, leave us some comments. Apologies for my grumpiness earlier. And apologies for her grumpiness. It's been a stressful day. Yeah. And <laughs> um, please leave us comments. Please give us a thumbs up and share. And subscribe if you haven't already because this really, really does help support us and what we are trying to do. It does. Um, so thank you again for watching and we will see you all soon uh, with Scooter Buddies. Lots love of love Bye. and take care. Bye.